In this video, I will be showing you guys a hidden setting to get no delay on GeForce Now. Before I do show you guys how to see the hidden setting, it's important to note that this is only for Windows and this is only for the GeForce Now app. I'm pretty sure that Macs already have this setting enabled by default, but if they don't then I will be posting a video on how to do it on Macs soon. So the first thing you're gonna do is right click on the GeForce Now app and click on open file location. And from here you're gonna click on geforcenow.json which is right below geforcenow.exe. If you can't see geforcenow.json then click on view at the top right over here. You're gonna check hidden items. So most people have it off by default but you're gonna check hidden items. And then right click on geforcenow.json Click on properties and make sure that read only and hidden are off. Once you unselect them, click on apply and then click on OK. So I've already unselected them. So I'm just going to click OK. So from here, you're going to right click over here and you're going to click open with and click open with notepad. Once the file opens up, we're going to change some settings. So the first thing I'm going to change is nv-sdl-vsync from true to false. So right over here, I'm just going to type in false. The next thing I'm going to change is nv-sdl-iohid configurable from false to true. So I'm just going to erase false over here and write true. Just make sure that you don't put any capitals or extra spaces. Just below that, I'm going to change nv-sdl-hidpi from false to true. So some people may have this on true already, but I don't have it on true. So I'm just going to type true over here. The last thing I'm going to change is nb-def-window-size. So for this one, you want to change these existing numbers right over here and you're going to change it to your screen resolution. So because my screen resolution is 1920 by 1080, I'm going to put those numbers in. Once you've done all of the steps, you're going to click on file and you're going to click on save over here or you can just do control S as well. Now that we have saved the file, just open up GeForce Now. And from here, you're going to click on menu settings and then scroll all the way down. You will see a setting that was previously hidden called direct mouse input, which minimizes mouse latency during your gameplay. For the most part, it does help reduce input delay to a minimum, but it, it can actually make the delay worse on some systems. So make sure to turn it on if it's not on already, then run a game to see the difference in delay. So just go back to games and then just run any of the games. Anyways, I hope this video helped. If it did, please leave a like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.